you know, like everybody else that is considering coming down to Tijuana, you have those like assumptions of what Tijuana's like. Yeah. You know what I mean? Like you hear the stories, you watch the news and all those different things. And and I'd been coming to Mexico. I love Mexico and I've been coming to Mexico for 30 years now. But uh, but like the Tijuana area is always like, you just drive by only in the day and you'd go surfing and then you drive back or like stay at a really safe hotel and serve. And of course you got to take necessary precautions, but I didn't know what to expect the first time coming to CPI for treatment. And I mean, I, I was really just pleasantly surprised, long story short, like in a really killer, I'm at the Hyatt place right in the center of town and like blown away by how good the cuisine is here and like the, the culture and the people, like everybody's super chill. There's like, I don't know. I just don't feel, I don't feel like it's unsafe here at all. Like I feel like the, the overall experience of being in, in Tijuana is super positive one and I didn't hesitate at all to bring my wife back this time like yeah. you know it's not it's like a non-issue for me yeah the media blows it up we got those guys that lost their lives I don't know it was like an hour and a half two hours down the beach yeah. you know which is here, terrible you know it is it's terrible it's awful yeah uh you know but if you go looking for problems you're gonna have one you know I, I kind of looked into like what the media was talking about with what, what was here it was like oh you broke into private property it was by a private airstrip truckload of guys came to rob you and you fought them you know, well, you know, you could be in the wrong part of LA. <laughs> you could definitely be on the wrong side of the North shore and five guys approach you on private property and you try to fight them and you, you know, you might I'm not say you end up dead, but you definitely get your ass kicked. Yeah. Well, I mean, the, uh, the, the bottom line is that, you know, there's, there's, there's danger anywhere. Yeah. And if you don't take necessary precautions, then, you know, you put yourself in harm's way a lot of times. And even if you do take precautions, a lot of times, you know, you just get unlucky and that's how life is. But I, I it's not going to stop me from coming back to Mexico. I love Mexico. Oh, it's yeah, a real place. I, mean, I come to Mexico multiple times. 99.9999%, you know, great. I, yeah. I honestly tell people this all the time. Like, I feel it's way shadier in LA right now. When I go up there to see my brother, Ed and I went up there to meet with the Red Bull guys. We went out on Hollywood. We stayed at the Roosevelt, went walking on Hollywood Boulevard, like 11 o'clock mm -hmm. to get pizza. Dude, it was night of the living base heads. Like it was yeah. crazy. I'm like, this is Hollywood now. Like I was shocked. You know, I took my watch off. I put my phone yeah. in my front pocket, my wallet in my front pocket. And, uh, I mean, we're both black belts, you know, like I'm not, you know, you know, kind of feel like I can protect myself, you know, more than the average person, but I never felt the least bit nervous about anything yeah especially be cautious and back and forth go. from the clinic you know you're like oh you're right by the beach yeah you're in the sprinter van you're at the hotel and like yeah. the nicest area of tj you know i'm sure if you're out and about late at night doing something dumb you might get robbed yeah it's, you know, it's, it's good to be cautious no matter you where could, you could go that could happen anyway yeah but i don't feel i don't feel that here at all and the the whole operation as far as like Oh, just be downstairs in the lobby at eight o'clock. We're picking you up. Sprinter van pulls up. You go to your appointments, go to get your MRIs, meet your doctors, get your scans, do the medical review, do your updates, do your IVs. And all. it's just, it's like a seamless experience. It's killer. It's, I'm it. We got it all down. 